What's good, YouTube? We are back again with another video. And we have here for you a custom, authentic, elite, right? That's a key word here. Aaron Rodgers, New York Jets jersey. In general, it's a dope jersey. I think the alternate jerseys are fire. I do have a white Sauce Gardner. I do have a green Quinnen Williams. And I now have a black Aaron Rodgers. I was able to get this on Fanatics for 30% off. They shoot out 30% discounts often almost every week if not every other week so i was able to get this custom elite jersey for about 250 bucks I believe i had some fan cash so that took off a little bit of the price as well and this is my first aaron Rodgers jets jersey i don't think i plan on getting any more um they did release a throwback version but i don't think that's going to release in the new elite jerseys we'll see as of right now this is what we got we have the black jersey this is my first black alternate jersey for the new york jets um so i'm excited that it's an aaron Rodgers as well i told my dad this if they win the super bowl which i don't think is gonna happen but you never know right we seen what brady did in tampa bay which i think they have a solid chance of making to the playoffs you just never know but if they can win the super bowl within this next two years um i will get a wilson jersey as well and i will get a Brees hall jersey Right, those will be my next two jerseys if they win the Super Bowl. If you guys aren't familiar with a custom jersey, it's a blank jersey, right? And then at that point, you could put anybody's number and name on it on the team. You could also customize it. You could actually put your own number and your own name on it as well, as long as it fits the custom rules. Now that Aaron Rodgers is officially on the New York Jets, it's a little pop-up window. You can pick literally anybody's name on the team. I decided to go with Aaron Rodgers because... For whatever reason, I don't know if it's because we're not in the season, but they don't have any Jets jerseys other than Zach Wilson. That's never going to happen. <laughs> Zach Wilson is wild doo-doo. Do I think they're going to make retail jerseys for the Jets? Yes, because of Aaron Rodgers' popularity. It's a new jersey. You have a lot of hype on the New York Jets at the moment. They're doing the hard knocks. So I think they will make regular jerseys, but they have to get them produced. And by the time they roll those out, it may be in the middle of the season, maybe in the end of the season. That's just how Nike works sometimes. This is the only way you can get an elite jersey for Aaron Rodgers on the New York Jets is this route, right? There's no other way you could do it. Maybe the stadium, and I am going to a Jets-Chiefs game. Sunday Night Football should be great. Uh, we got awesome seats, so I will be going to that game. I will see if the stadium sells elite jerseys i'll gladly let everybody know that they do sell elite jerseys all right so here we go with the black aaron Rodgers authentic elite let me wipe this camera down real quick i want to make sure you get in the highest quality possible right so they only had a size 52 at the time i think right now it's sold out uh so whatever sizes they had left at one point, they only had a size 52. Sometimes sizes pop back on. This is a size 52. Now, you have the cut sleeves like the Elite jerseys normally have. You have your Nike patch swoosh. Right? You have this green fabric that cuts into a point. Uh, something that I like, actually. And then you have the numbers... And on a custom, it's going to be double stacked. So you have green twill on as a base layer. And then you have the white twill as the top layer, right? One thing that I do like about these jerseys is the New York and this twill across. Something a little bit different. Something we've never seen on a Jet jersey before. You do have your NFL Shield logo in that metallic. Really nice. Now, you do have your tags. I will show you the tags. It says 296 bucks. These are probably from the first year this new jersey came out. But to make a custom, it's about $369. It was $250 with the discount 30% off. I'm trying to make sure that I'm somewhat centered. And then we have the back. Very dope. And we have a single stitched Rogers on the back on the nameplate. 
double stacked eight. Very clean. The green on the Jets jerseys are close to a forest green. I would say somewhere between a forest green and your regular standard green. It's a little bit darker. So for example, I do have a Jordan 3 pine green. And you can see this green is just a little bit on the brighter side, I guess, compared to it. But it's actually fairly close. So this is definitely something I can consider wearing with this jersey. This would be a great little combination, right? And then you have the jock tag. You have the satin jog tag, nicely done. Now this is the old Elite run. I know they're going to a new Fuse edition. I do not own a Fuse Elite yet. If I do pick up one, it may be a Pat Mahomes version, just to have a newer style from him, and I will review that jersey. Right now, currently, they only have Cowboys jerseys available for the Nike Fuse Elite jerseys, right? The panels are a little bit different. The perforations are a little bit different. I would love to get my hands on one. So we could see a comparison and how they fit. Um, hopefully they fit closer to these. I guess that's something that I will see once I get my hands on one, right? Again, I don't know if all the teams are going to the new Vapor Fuse Elite style, but we will see, right? The main differences are the paneling, different mesh panels on the new Vapor Fuse. And definitely the collar has a completely different collar now. So this mesh chain mail that you get on this Nike Elite it's a different design on the new Fuse jerseys, right? But this is a clean jersey, size 52. I'm undecided on which jersey I'm going to wear for the Chiefs game. They are wearing the throwback, um, the new throwback, actually. And they are actually honoring Mark Gastineau at that game. So I'm undecisive of whether I should rock this jersey, the Quentin Williams or the Source Gardner. The Source Gardener is the closest one to the throwback because it is in white. But again, we'll see, right? But this is your Aaron Rodgers Elite jersey. Size 52. Let me put it on for you really quickly. You're not going to be able to see it all, unfortunately, because the way the camera is just set up at the moment. Eventually, I would say by September, October, I should have all of the stuff cleared out. And the camera setup should be the same exact position that it was before, right? All right, so a lot of people are going to say this fits perfect, and I think it does. This is a good-looking jersey, right? My preference of size in this jersey is a size 48. It fits me nice and athletic. I have plenty of sizing videos, so go check that out. If you look up Nike NFL sizing jersey, I'm sure my video is going to pop up within the first few videos. What I like about these jerseys is I can wear a size 52 as well. So for some reason, like this scenario, they didn't have a size 48. I went to a size 52 and it still looks really good. This is your Aaron Rodgers, New York Jets, authentic elite jersey. This may be the first elite jersey on YouTube for Aaron Rodgers on the jet, that is. I have actually like three more Aaron Rodgers jerseys and uh, they're all for the Packers. So pretty cool to get. A-Rod on the Jets. Hopefully we can make the playoffs. I'll be satisfied with that. To me, that'll be a successful season, right? I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And on that note, we out. Peace.